Welcome to the Coach and Crew Show. It's Super Bowl time. We have been here with you all season long, and now it's time for the big one, the grand finale. I would say the granddaddy of them all, but this isn't the Rose Bowl. It is a Super Bowl. And ironically, the Super Bowl started with the name of Lamar Hunt of the Kansas City Chiefs. Kansas City Chiefs are back in the Super Bowl. They're taking on the Philadelphia Eagles. We go through, we talk about what we see, what we like, and who we are going to pick slash curse uh, to win each game. So far, I'm going to be honest, I am undefeated with teams not named Philadelphia or Kansas City. Problem is, the teams in the Super Bowl are Philadelphia and Kansas City. So I've been doing all things considered really, really well, but eventually I've got to continue cursing somebody or getting somebody for right for the first time. We'll see how that goes. Joining me as always are Phil, a.k.a. Tantor, and Devin. So before we get started, I am going to ask everybody, please go to coachingcrewshow.com. Visit our website. Make sure you like. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you also comment away on your video, Who on these videos. Who do you have winning the Super Bowl and why so? Byron picks the Kansas City Chiefs. Luke picks the Philadelphia Eagles. So we're already at one-to-one -one before we get going. Phil. Well, a lot of me really wants Harrison Buckner to hit the game-winning field goal on this one. But I, I just can't stay in Kansas City. And I just can't stand Philadelphia Eagles. So that's a tough one. So we're going to go with defense. They say defense wins championships. We're going to go with the defense. Philadelphia Eagles, defense. And Devin, I know you were hoping to be picking against Phil. Are we picking against Phil or are we picking with Phil? I mean, I'd love to go against Phil, but I, I really do see the Eagles winning this one. I don't. I think the Eagles are such a better team than them, and the only place where they lack compared to the Kansas City Chiefs is coaching, and that's nothing against Patrick Mahomes, but it's all to Jalen Hurts for having an MVP-like season, and he's playing to a great quarterback level. They have a great defense. They're facing one of the best pass-protecting um, offensive lines, but they have one of the best defensive pass-rushing defensive lines, so I, I think they'll etch it out in the end, and I think it's going to be at least – 10-point lead at the end of the game. I'm going to take a hybrid of both of your conversations, and unfortunately, that means Byron's doing the lone wolf. He'll get two points if he gets this one right for lone wolfing. I'm taking the Eagles, and here's what it comes down to. Strength versus strength. Kansas City's O-line, I actually have honestly been very impressed with this entire playoff run. Philadelphia's defensive line, I have been impressed with this entire season. I think at the end of the day, the Phil, defense. We're going to take the defense. That Philadelphia offense, now you can make fun of who they've played in certain situations, but they're still putting up points on everybody. I, I think Philadelphia's going to be able to stop Kansas City, and I think they're going to be able to put up enough points on Kansas City's defense, and that's going to be enough. I, I personally think the only way the Eagles lose this game is if – Andy Reid and his coaching staff come in there with an amazing game plan, and they know something that no one else in the league knows, and they somehow shut down that Philly offense. That can happen, though, because take a look. The best team, Cincinnati, when they played Kansas City, Cincinnati was the better team. Kansas City was the team playing better in that game. Yeah. And that could happen this time, too. Andy Reid is a better coach than Suriano. Yeah, far. so – they could do it, and they have a magician at quarterback. So if you want a team that uh, can make some magic happen, Kansas City could do it. But, again, I like Philly's defense. I've been riding them all season, and I, I think they can get it done this year. All right, folks, the one thing that's so far that we, we've kind of determined is both teams look as healthy as they're going to be this late in the season, not only the last late in the season, the final game of the season and we all think it's it should be close if it turns out to be a blowout so be it but it's going to be an interesting matchup again coachingcrewshow.com make sure you like subscribe and comment to who you have winning super bowl 57 thanks for watching
before we get the giggles too bad, y'all ready to start doing some Super Bowling? No, <laughs> that's funny. Because I'm still giggling. I'm still giggling. Too Thomas hard. L. What do you think we are, professional actors? Give me I'm a break. still giggling too hard. <laughs>